so we have another question to solve so the question says a ball is the ball one is dropped from rest from an initial height h at the same instant ball two is launched vertically upwards with an initial velocity u okay at what time both the balls at the same distance from the ground so first understand what it says it says like um there is a ball which is dropped from this height and at the same instance one ball is thrown upwards okay. so suppose they meet here okay so the total height from where the ball one has been thrown or dropped we can say is h so total height is h we will use a small h so what will be the time so for this question what we have to do first see suppose that this is h1 height so this height will be h minus h1 okay we have assumed that it is h1 okay so the second sweat equation that was s equal to ut plus half at square will be used in this question how it will be used just look into it so first we will assume that ball is here and we will use this sweat equation for this height so h1 is equal to and the notation for downwards is positive and for upwards is negative okay so the initial velocity is zero because we have dropped from the rest so this component will be zero plus half g t square g is positive because it's downward h1 equals to half g t square now we will do the similar thing for lower one okay h minus h1 equals to that is s u t u and t because t is the same time where it is meeting then minus half g t square why minus because the notion for what is minus so this is for uh, lower part and h1 was for upper part then we will add both the equations 1 and 2 we will get that h equals to and this portion will goes off with this so we will left with u t what we have done is 1 plus 2 we have done one first equation added in second equation so t equals to h by u okay so at h by u is c option c option should be the right answer for this question now we will check the mark skin yes c option is the right so the questions like this you have to you have to analyze that which SWOT equation you can use and how you have to use it okay thank you for watching this video